Good luck in the draft. Thank you. The big thing for us is if Emmanuel Forbes is sitting there, an opportunity for us to get our guy. I thought about playing in the NFL since the first time I stepped on a football field. With the 16th pick in the 2023 NFL Draft, the Washington Commanders select. You got a favorite for us? A favorite? Yeah. Not anybody that's going to help us win. I like that then. We'll find the right one. Good luck. All right, love you. We'll need a little bit of it. The amazing thing about all this, all that work that our scouts start and our scouts do for over a year, it all comes down to a matter of hours. The combine is, is a special uh, event because it really, you know, hammers down and like nails home some of the stuff that we've learned about these kids. We've, we've been scouting these kids for um, two, three, sometimes uh, four years. Like you go all fall talking to groups of people that know these kids, so just different perceptions on these kids, but then you actually get to sit down and talk to these kids. <laughs> I guess the most impressive thing to me this week was Emmanuel Forbes' interview process. I heard a rumor from the offensive coaches at Mississippi State, they kept trying to move you to offense. I did. Is that true? It is true. <laughs> we had the chance to formal interview him, and his ability to communicate with confidence really left our defensive staff, our coordinators, and all our executives, frankly, speechless. Inside. Yeah, you got to move. That's mandatory inside. Okay, and what if he goes radically outside? You got to turn into him and carry him a little longer. So I can, like, force him, try to push him out of bounds. Instead of turning inside, I'm going to just turn into him and just get my special quarterback. So he won't do it. His ability to communicate teach their defense um, was frankly impressive and we kind of viewed him as a plug-and-play player based on his intelligence and athleticism alone. Yeah. What do you do best in the football part? Uh, honestly, communication. We're real big on communication. So for everybody to know what everybody has to do, and I'm really good at knowing what other guys have to do. So if they don't know, I can like tell yeah. uh, You did a nice job talking about the guys around you. What's the best way for these guys to coach you? Uh, I'm a visual learner, so you can put it on the board and I can go do it right then and there. Uh, take good notes, you don't need to. I take notes, but. Yeah. All right, cool, I appreciate it, thank yes, you. That's all right. Yes, sir. Excited. Excited. Thanks for the time. Great job. Nice to meet you. Great job. We have a stack of players that we really like, you know, starting with defensive backs and offensive linemen, and that's the hard part is we don't know how those guys are going to come off the board. The big thing for us is if Emmanuel Forbes is sitting there, there's an opportunity for us to get our guy. thought about playing in the NFL since the first time I stepped on a football field. Get another pick by Forbes, and then he takes it to the house. Oh, I just keep working, stay in school. Who has the most pick sixes in FBS and SEC history? And it's blocked. Off. Emmanuel Forbes. Once I wasn't able to play baseball, it really became reality that I really want to play football, and it's something I just pursued my whole life. Oh, it was crazy. It was a lot of hearts has been broken here on this field, and it wasn't ours. So we rarely lost at home, honestly. And it was just, oh, this was full. He is playing all over the place, and it was a great atmosphere. So, going on. Who is that? What's up, man? Not what, much. You do, what you doing? Here to give a I gift. Do. Yeah, I promise. I got you one, sir. Good luck, man. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. All right, <laughs> all right coach. Good to yes, sir. Yes, sir. All right, coach. Good luck. Nice <laughs> yes, to get her. Where is she at? She's out today. Yeah. Everybody's out today. I know. <laughs> How you doing? Hi. You come up here today? Yes, ma'am. Uh -huh. Yes, ma'am. 
Good seeing y'all. Weird though. Uh, Grenada Fieldhouse, Grenada Football Fieldhouse, and you know, probably one of the best in the States for a high school. So we take pride and joy, and you see, it helped a lot of us out and get to where we want to be. And there's something we look forward to and try to keep going with the kids. So here's some of the old uh, jerseys that NFL guys and a couple Mississippi State guys and guys who went to college and did really well. So, you know, you want your name on one of these, to be honest. Well, that's a, I only got three more game jerseys, and I want, you can keep that one and keep the name on the back, and I can send one over at that. Can... I'll hold on to this, and uh -huh. you come back, bring one. Yeah, okay. All right. All right, baby. Good seeing you. Yeah. 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 Tonight, I'm spending time with my family, my friends, and my close ones, honestly, and we're coming, all coming together tonight to enjoy this night for me and hopefully, you know, hear my name called early, and I really appreciate that from them. Yeah. Yeah. What's up with you? <laughs> Chilling, man. You ready? Yeah. What's up? You look clean, man. You, you look clean. clean. <laughs> Chilling, man. Mm. I can just go in. <laughs> yeah, <I lie. laughs> you alright? Yes. Hey, how you doing? How you doing? Yeah. Oh, I'm so proud yes, of you. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Chris Owens, we told me to tell you uh -huh. congratulations. Mm -hmm. He loves you mm -hmm. and he's praying for you. Yes, ma'am. And if you ever need him, call him. If you ever get any type that you need prayer, mm -hmm. you call him really. Yes, ma'am. Because he'll be there for you. Yes, ma'am. Thanks. Yes, ma'am. 6.42 right now. Uh, 18 minutes. <laughs> hey, Elliot. How you doing, man? Hey, could you ask me to send a moving back from there to uh, 16? Hey, what are you looking for? <laughs> Okay, thanks. I'll give you a call back. Okay. I'll call them anyway. Oh. See, would they be willing to move back? And they said they would. He asked for our third. I said, not. I said we might do our fourth. Um, that might make some sense if he doesn't go. Yeah. With these seven picks, in the 2023 NFL Draft, with the, eighth pick. with the ninth pick, with the tenth pick in the 2023 NFL Draft. Hey, we got a lot of picks. He's probably the coolest guy up there. Hey, Elliot. Uh, I don't think he gets past the Packers. Yeah, I don't think he's good by himself. Sorry about that. Let me talk to Coach Spider. I'll get the call back. No, we don't. We know it's late. No, that's yeah. all right because of where we are. Yeah. Yeah. With the 11th pick, with the 12th pick in the 2023 NFL draft. Oh. Packers select Lucas Vaness. and then the Jets. Vaness just got taken. So we could end up in one of the two corners. So we're good right where we are. Yeah. We're going to stay for you. Let me just jump in here. The Patriots, with just a couple minutes left before choosing 14th overall, just made a deal with Pittsburgh. So far, so good. Promise you, there's Forbes. Jack's going to do some flip flops. Oh, there it is. Uh, Will McDonald. Oh, yeah. Great, Jack. He's staring at you. Yeah. Manuel Forbes. Yeah. 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 Yeah, we're gonna call, I'm about to call him. You ready? All right, we're going to call him. 
We're calling. Hello. Hello, Emmanuel, please. Yes, yeah, that's him. Emmanuel, this is Coach Ron Rivera with the Washington Commanders. How you doing? I'm good. How are you? I'm good. You ready to play some football? I'm ready right now. Okay, you can play some football for the Washington Commanders, man. Yes, sir. You're gonna yes, be, sir. You're gonna be our, you're gonna be our first round pick, pick number 16. Yes. All right. Yes, sir. Hey, it's an opportunity for you to do things that you did uh, all those years down there. We need you to do yes, the same sir. thing for us. All right. Hey, congratulations, man. Very happy. Yes, for sir. You. All right. Yes, sir. Thank you. All right. Washington. changer uh, I think people throw around the term ball hawk you know pretty loosely uh, but this guy really is that today I'm going to Mississippi to pick up Emmanuel Forbes and bring him back and introduce him to the community seems to be like a, a hell of a young man he's confident in what he does I, he knows he's a good football player. He seems to be an outstanding uh, young person, um, high character guy. Um, so I'm looking forward to working with him. What's up? Congrats, Big Daddy. Got you. Yes, Got you in the house. Emmanuel Forbes here. I'm on my way to Washington and I'm excited to meet y'all and just get to know y'all better. I'm excited about you meeting the locker room and your, your room, nah. your group, nah. the DVs, the safeties. Oh man, it's a great to produce. Yeah, great. You got some vets, you got some young cats in there, and you got some ballers in there. Yeah, I mean, you got some guys that's gonna play a long time in this sport at a high level, and they're starting now to. I'm starting now to see some of them young got cats grow. Can't wait to see you grow. Uh, that's gonna be fun to watch. Yeah. You know. Hey. Hey, how's it going? Welcome, man. Yes, sir. Thank Appreciate you. Appreciate you being here. Yes, sir. It's good to have you, too. Yes, it really is welcome. Yes, Who do you got with you? Uh, sister, mom, girlfriend, marketing agent. Hi, Ron Rivera. How are you? Please, come come out of the rain, please. <laughs> we're, we're very excited about yes, it, you know. But uh, there you go. <laughs> you know the crew. They were anxious. I told you, man. I know. All right. All right. Congrats. Yes, awesome. sir. Dude, man. Good Appreciate to see you. That. Appreciate it. We got three of those right there, and we need to get a couple more. Plan That's why you're here, all right? Yes, That's sir. That's why you're here. Yes, Help sir. us get to that, all right? Uh, my family means a lot, honestly. They, the reason I'm here where I am right now today, because they've pushed me hard, they've challenged me, and it honestly have helped me out for the best. Family means a lot. Cause really, that's all we have, and our family, since our family is so big, ten siblings and all, and me and Emmanuel or Junior, um, are the last two. He is the ninth. He is the ninth, and I am the tenth. It was still competitive, and they used to just make me compete with everything, and they used to challenge me like my brother, older brother, used to tell me every day, "Be better than what I am." Always, that's one thing that stuck with me: be better than I am, be better than I'm. I used to tell him I want to be like him when I grow up, because he was a really good football player, and you know they just stuck with me. And look at me now. Here you go. <laughs> this is yours. It's official now. Uh, All right. Yes, yes, sir. Congratulations. Yes, sir. All right. What's going on? Welcome to the family, baby. <laughs> Appreciate it. Everything good with you? Oh, yeah. Trip was good? Oh, yeah. You read? I know you had a long night, right? Come on. <laughs> well, that means a lot to be from Grenada, Mississippi. So, you know, we got a population of maybe like 20,000, and we have 
six guys in the NFL. So that's a big sports like town. They take their sports very serious. A lot of dogs on this. I don't even know how else to put it. A lot of guys that want to be great. And they, you see, like I when I was growing up, I see them guys going to college and see them guys getting drafted and all this type of stuff. And it makes me, when I was growing up, I wanted to do that. You know, I wanted to be a part of that. Emmanuel Forbes now, Mississippi State. I know. I like this guy. He one of the guys that he, uh, he's got some of you in him now. He's 166 pounds. That's gonna be that's the no problem. That's no problem though. That's he no is problem. long. He's got six. He's got six pick sixes in his career. He's just a ball magnet. That's all that matters. When he first started college football, we didn't know that he was gonna get like to the NFL. We didn't know that. Like even when he was in high school, he had a lot of people doubt him because he was just skinny. He was underweight. Nobody ever thought that he would like even get this big. And for him to get this big in my small town, like we have NFL players that's like from our town, but not to go just first round. I did not want to lose to nobody. I'm the I'm not gonna lie, I'm the biggest sore loser you ever been in your life. I hate I hate losing more than I like winning. So that tells you a lot about how competitive I am. <laughs> <laughs> it's all good, it's all over. Yes, it, it is, it is. Yeah. Well, welcome home, baby. Mm -hmm. The work just started now. Just huh? started. Yeah, it just started now. <laughs> Drop started. What were you thinking? I don't know. It was like seeing one corner go off the board. And I was just like, me and my agent texting. He was like, I feel like I'm going to Washington, to be honest. But I don't know because like ain't no you other corner. That, really? Yeah, you can <laughs> go look at the message. Yeah, I did. All right, all right, all right. Okay. <laughs> so I all feel right. like I'm going to Washington. But all I know is like, ain't no corners been picked up. I don't know what's going on. It's just. It got weird because, like, when I told everybody, I think Washington gonna pick me up. Everybody migrated right before y'all pick, and y'all haven't called yet. And I was like, "Ooh, they ain't called. <laughs> <laughs> they haven't. They haven't called yet. I don't know." Let's introduce to you Emmanuel Forbes, our first round draft pick. Uh, it just feels so real, you know. Uh, came here for a 30 visit, enjoyed it, got, met some great people, and now I'm here for good now and just ready to go to work. How you feeling, my friend? Feeling good, feeling excited, honestly, and ready to get to work. Has it sunk in yet? I know it's so sudden, so soon, but have you kind of been able to digest a little bit? Oh, it's hit me a little bit right now, but it hasn't really sunk in, honestly. I'm just waiting for it to. <laughs> what is your message to Washington Commanders fans out there? Uh, get ready to win games. You ready to win games. Manuel Forbes, welcome to Washington. Yes, sir. No problem. <laughs> what up, yo? What up, Wish? You good? Congrats, bro. Appreciate it. Appreciate yeah. it. Appreciate it. Big time, man. Happy for you. Nice to meet you. This is um, our family from Cha. Uh huh. Nice to meet y'all. What's your name? Emmanuel, Emmanuel. Nice to meet you. Emmanuel, nice to meet you. Emmanuel. Emmanuel, nice to meet you. Nice to meet y'all. Thank you guys. No problem, no problem. Gotta put some Washington gear on. What a day to be a commander. Crazy, right? Crazy $48 right now. Enjoy it, bro. Yeah. Emmanuel, welcome to the DMV, bro. Thank you, thank you. Glad to have you, glad to have you. Ready to work? I am. Ready to win some games, honestly. I know that's right. <laughs> I'm looking forward to it, brother. Uh -huh. Appreciate you. Going on, little man. <laughs> I will. I will. I will. Right here? You want me to put it up here? Hey. I want to say welcome to Washington. Yes, ma'am. I've been a fan since the 70s. Yes, ma'am. And I don't want an autograph, but I just want a picture. Yes, ma'am. Now, something I want to tell you. Mm -hmm. You have big shoes to fill, young man. Yes, ma'am. As I should. And, and, and the shoes you're going to fill is number 28. Yes, ma'am. And you know who that was? Who was that? Daryl Green, the fastest corner in the NFL. Yes, ma'am. So if you haven't watched his tape, uh -huh. you start studying. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> <laughs> I could get, can I hug you? Yes, right, you can. Yeah, have a good day. Daryl Green, yes. 28. Yes, you start studying that tape. I will, I will. Absolutely love the fans here. Love them. 
going on? What's going on? <laughs> Oh, it feels amazing, honestly, you know, the burger and gold. I'm ready to rep her every day. Let us introduce the 16th pick overall, Emmanuel Forbes Jr. Welcome to DC, baby! Oh, yeah. Thank you, thank you. Let's start right there, Emmanuel. How is this welcome to Washington, D.C. going for you so far? Oh, it's going good. I'm in love. Loving the energy right now. Loving the fans, you know, and just enjoying my time. Daniel, that smile, it says it all. Yeah. You've had now 48 hours for it to settle in. Mm -hmm. Has it hit you yet? With everybody coming out here, seeing what you're going to get on game day, that you are now the next commander? Yes, it has hit me, and I'm enjoying every moment of it. <laughs> hey, congratulations, all righty? Yes, sir, thank you. All right, Quan. bye now. All right, bye. Commanders. Yeah! Your boy KJ Henry, number 55, second in. They had this great event. Appreciate you guys running back. I'm gonna have you on short. We had top golf with it, man. You know what I'm saying? We got the running backs right here. We go check in on KJ, man. I'm checking in. 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 I'